Hello and welcome to Let's Play Mega Maker. My name is Joe. And I'm gonna play a level called Pharaoh's. Um, it's a good start. Pharaoh Man's heavily guarded tomb created by Don't Play My Levels. Very promising name. I uh, played four times and the score is positive too. It was a randomly selected level. So let's check it out. So here is Pharaoh Man. Oh yeah, alright. So this is a heavily guarded tomb, I guess. Well, that's what the title suggests. I have only Mega Buster here. Can I charge? Oh no 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 don't do this to me. Okay. Okay, it looks like I have the Mega Man 5 style charge. It's really powerful. Even it's heavily guarded, it doesn't look that bad so far. It's a little bit risky to stand there, but I don't care. Ooh, I see. And this section will may cause some problems. Yeah, definitely. Okay, I lost way too much HP there, but at least there is a checkpoint and I died, but I don't really mind it because I will be back with full HP, so that's good. Um, probably I made a mistake here though. Mm, yeah. This is the fastest way to fix my shit I, I did there. Ooh, okay, that was close. Oh no, nah, I couldn't jump there, maybe if I would go to the right, or oh, whatever. Hmm, wait a minute. Oh, okay, I see. I was checking out for the reason I couldn't jump up there, but obviously the only way to do that after you fall down to damage boost using the spikes. However, it's not the easiest thing in all the situations. The screen transitions are a little bit weird in this level, I think, I mean... They are a little bit way too often and you don't really see what's next. Uh, other, than that, other than that I'm not complaining about this level because it, it's not bad. It's not one of, oh, okay. It's not one of the one of those levels where you blindly jump into a spike, so you can kinda expect where you are going to fall, except for here, where I Use my slide and blindly went into a spike. Just like this time again. It looks like it will be a hard decision to judge this level. Yeah, definitely. Because I don't really like the way the screen transitions are. Uh, other than that, it's a fun level. So I don't even, I don't really know what to say. Mm, that sucks. Okay. Alright. 
Okay, I need to be careful here. Don't jump. Oh, and yeah, and this part again. One of those parts. And one of those parts again. I need to be real careful here. Oh god. Huh. Oh, I see. I need a really good timing, however, there is a... Maybe now... Oh, I thought it will... Okay, I see. This level is harder than it looks. Well, maybe at the end of the day, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it's really a heavily guarded tomb. But also, I'm gonna defeat it, so I don't mind it. Okay, this section again. I need to be careful not to be crushed to the ceiling okay okay and this part is really interesting maybe my timing was absolutely bad ah okay This level is kicking my ass, but it's also my mistake. But uh, there are some difficulties for real. Okay. That was a good shot at least. Hmm. I'm trying to rush through that part, but I lost uh, so much HP there. Ah, oh, again. Oh, no, no, no. Damage boost, please. Thanks. Okay, so this section is really interesting, I guess. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. My timing was absolutely wrong. I saw it coming. I complain about this level the, the screen transitions are kind of weird to be honest and uh, sometimes you are not able to see what's coming next Some parts of the level it's fine, but when you are at a place like this, you can easily fall down if you are not cautious enough. Or here, you, I'm jumping and uh, I'm, I almost went into the spikes. Okay, let's try this way. Okay. I was lucky. Oh, okay. And the checkpoint, I really appreciate that. Ooh, lots of tallies. Tallies are kinda cute, so... Okay, this section... will be a little bit difficult because of that... pickaxe asshole. If I am able to defeat him then it will be probably a piece of cake 
I'm not sure about this section. Where to go? Okay, this way. Fine. Another checkpoint. I'm really glad. Oh, I didn't see that coming though. I was about to jump to the bomb platform with the seven timer, but I definitely made a mistake there. Okay, I can go. Two sniper Joes. Actually, this looks like a fun part of the level. I really like the variety in this level. It's not just the same thing all over again. It's truly a level that I it, it feels hard to judge because Oh well I don't find it this part really fair. Oh really? May I call it unfair man? Sorry that was really bad. Okay, now what am I supposed to do here? Oh, I don't, I don't know. I only have the. Okay, good. Oh no 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 no! I don't like this. Okay. Oh. Great, and probably the boss fight is here, and the checkpoint I hope, yes. Alright, finally, finally the boss fight. And I have really mixed feelings about this level. The thing is that I mostly enjoyed it. However, some parts felt unfair. Thanks to the screen transitions, instead of making one long corridor, uh, the different parts were, you know, separated or split into multiple parts. And uh, sometimes you didn't really know what, what's next. And that's it. Well, the problem is that I can say many good things and many bad things about this level. I mean, not, not so many bad things, but they kind of uh, make the level go to the thumbs down area. But the positive things are balancing it. Because in overall it was a fun level, but it was flowed uh, in a way so the screen transitions made it a little bit unfair at some points there was the teleporter part where you had to fall into the teleport and uh, I had no idea where to jump or there wasn't any sign where to go and it was definitely a trap and uh, you had to be really lucky to not missing the teleporter there. Um, the other sections, like when you, when you came out um, to the upper part of the level, I think that was fun. Um, the challenges weren't that uh, unfair though. I mean the separated 
challenges like those beam parts. Dying there was my mistake, however when I went through one screen to the other and I fell uh, into the spikes I feel like it was a little bit unfair how it worked because um, it was easy it was really easy to just slide or jump into the next screen and fall into the spikes and die uh, so it felt like a little bit of um, luck based on trial and trial and error uh, and that that's one thing that I dislike about this level however most of the parts were fine and really enjoyable but um, I really wish uh, the corridors weren't this uh, separated. I mean, they were separated by they were separated every 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 screen basically. And that's one thing that I I don't really like. Some of the in some of the cases. It's not a big problem, uh, but this level definitely wasn't the best to showcase the screen transitions. So let's see, here is one, here it's, it's merged, so this is good. This is split into two parts, again I don't know what for what reason. Uh, this looks okay, three blocks here. Uh, this definitely doesn't look good because you can accidentally go here really easily. As you think about it, you are jumping here, screen transition. Uh, uh, okay, you are not jumping that high. And screen transition and you are in the spikes. That's bad. Again, this part, I disagree on this. Uh, I'm not sure why is it not uh, split into two parts. That feels a little bit awkward. Uh, same about this part, this part, this part. Yeah, so definitely uh, it feels unnecessary and kind of ruins the stage. And uh, that's a little bit disappointing because the stage itself and this part felt really unfair but most of the part the stage was really fine but too bad, too bad about these mistakes it's a little bit disappointing because it should have been a really good level in overall and I really wanted to give it a thumbs up but um, the way how the screen transitions were handled just I did I didn't really like it. Yeah, so this should be like this. This should be like this. This should be like this. It kind of feels like it was done the opposite way as it should have been. Okay, this way. Of course, the screen transition here is fine. I'm not sure about this again. Um, it's okay-ish, yet um, I'm not sure. Yeah, it's 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 really like uh, it was made the opposite way it should have been. Now the teleporter, I'm not gonna do anything, and of course, I don't. I don't really want to ruin this level, I mean, <laughs> it's not my level, so I shouldn't do this, but... But I'm, I'm gonna try it out this way, quickly. So let's see the difference. I think I... I did it every area. Definitely feels a little bit better this way. Of course, I need to be careful here. S 
same about this part and it was definitely just my mistake so it's completely fine I'm not gonna replay this level, but I just want to prove my point. Okay, so here is this part. It's really dangerous because of the Help me out. Great. I shouldn't take this many ma this much damage, but oh, I was so close to the half pickup. Uh, whatever. I got the. I got into the checkpoint. I got to the checkpoint, so it's fine. I don't really. I don't really get why the. Why that weapon power pickup was there weapon energy this level just uses the buster so maybe originally it was designed to use some other weapons and uh, maybe the creator of the level left it there I'm not sure about it to be careful here okay this is a part where uh, it should be separated because because of the timer basically so it's impossible to do this part uh, maybe it's not actually okay I, I did it <laughs> And this part shouldn't be impossible because because there are the Yoko blocks that help me out there. Okay, so I, I'm not sure about the timing. Probably this is one of those parts where I would appreciate the oh oh no haha <laughs> yeah. So this is one of those parts where the rooms should be separated. Whatever, I'm, I'm not going to play this through. Uh, I think these little tweaks make the level a little bit better, in my opinion. So that was the Pharaoh's heavily guarded tomb. And while I enjoyed most of the parts of the level, and uh, there was little, little problems with the screen transitions, uh, made me not giving a thumbs up for this level. I'm sorry about that, but uh, sometimes I felt it unfair and uh, in an overall not so good level design. So thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, subscribe for more gameplay videos, probably I'm gonna play Dark Wood soon. And also don't forget to sub submit your levels in the comment section or in MegaMaker community Facebook group you should join uh, it's a really good community we are giving really useful feedbacks to each other and sharing levels there um, so you can find really cool levels and also you can share your level there and if you want feedback you can ask so that's it. Again, thanks for watching. See you later.